Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to check the HRC Ford 55A 4-in-1 ESC. In this video I'm going to go over its features and specs and hopefully soon I'm going to feature it in the build video. In addition, one of you lucky subscribers is going to win this 4-in-1 ESC which is going to be directly sent to the winner by HRC and in the end of this video I'm going to let you know how to participate in the giveaway. In terms of packaging, inside its box along with the 4-in-1 ESC you are getting some stickers, a short user manual which includes the connection diagram, two 10 cm long 12 gauge battery leads, a high quality XT60 AMS battery connector, a 35 volts 1000 microfarad capacitor, an 8 pins harness for connecting the 4-in-1 ESC to a flight controller, and a bag that contains plastic M3 spacers and nuts and silicon grommets. In terms of features and specs, both on the top and on the bottom side of the board, you can find pretty big and well separated motor and battery pads, which are easy to work with and are going to reduce the chance of shorting things out. It can handle a steady current of 55A with a peak current of 65A for 10 seconds. It features a built in current sensor and supports ESC telemetry. It's running BL Heli32 firmware and its input voltage can handle between 3 to 6S lipo batteries. In addition to this 8 pins connector, you can also find these pads on the bottom, so in case this connector breaks, you can solder the flight controller directly to these pads. And by the way, the harness that comes with this 4-in-1 ESC matches the same layout of the Ford F7 flight controller. In addition, the bottom side of the board is conformal coated, which should reduce the chances of shorting things out in case you are going to get it wet. And this board features an F3 processor, which should make it more responsive. The weight of the board on its own is 15.7 grams, including the 35 volts 1000 microfarad capacitor it weighs 18 grams, and after adding the XT60 battery connector and the battery leads, it brings us to a total weight of 31.4 grams. Finally, the outer dimensions of this 4-in-1 ESC are 39.6 x 44.5 x 4.6 mm, and it's using 30.5 x 30.5 mm M3 mounting holes. So overall, the AGLRC FD55A looks like a very high quality 4-in-1 ESC and as it comes with a price tag of about $49, I think that it offers a budget-friendly alternative to its bigger brother, the FD60A, which costs about $27 extra. In case you would like to participate in the giveaway, all you have to do is to make sure that you are subscribed to my channel, hit the notifications bell and leave a single comment down below with a special number that you're going to get after joining all the digits that I spread in the video and by the way, this is the last one, and deduct the joint number from the product ID of the FD55A 4-in-1 ESC on Banggood's website. It might sound complicated, but it's actually pretty simple. As always, I thank you for watching my video, I hope you enjoyed it and you find it useful. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comment section down below, in addition to your answer if you would like to participate in the giveaway, and I will see you soon on my next videos. Goodbye.